and welcome to part 2. I ended part 1 about 10 seconds ago. I literally just stopped the recording and started the next one. But I just wanted to split it up a bit so that it wasn't an enormous file or something. It was, well, I when I was up at the mountain and checked, it was about 70 gig. Quite a lot. No, squid, don't die. You poor thing. Get out. There we go. Just saved a life. What have you done today? Not saved a life. I'm better than you. You lose. Where did Jamie go? I'm not sure. Hello skeleton. Goodbye skeleton. Um, I've lost him. Oh, hello creeper. How would it go? In Holy shit, I nearly died. I'm gonna try and keep my deaths to a minimum, especially because of the death counter up there. I, I'll i see how long I can go on zero. Um, probably won't be that long, but I'll try my best. Ah, he's headed back. I'll grab some coal as well because I completely ran out of that. Ah, I see his name tag. Why is he so low underground? Must be in a cave or something. Jamie, what are you doing down there? Oh, for fuck's sake, Jamie. <sighs> Jamie loves puns. A lot. Puns are great. I'm just gonna block this off, it's annoying. Go away. Oops. There we go. Oh fuck, what was that? Is he alive? Oh, why did I say what was that? It was a fucking creeper. What do you think? But is he alive still or did he die? Oh. Nope, he seems fine. Good, good. Oh! 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 I don't have any armor yet. So I need to be very careful. I probably should have made some. I might go do that now actually. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna head back, cause, oh, how do I get out of here though? I came in through the ceiling, so, how do I get out? I just saw an enderman, oh my god, that's terrifying. Hello, how's it going? Okay, let's... Oh, that's so scary. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Fuck off. Come back. Come back, Enderman. Please. Where'd he go? 
You going here? Yep, I nearly looked at him. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh, that is so tense. I'm not sure what scares me more, creepers or endermen. It's pretty close. Creepers are more of a jump scare, endermen are more of a scare scare. Like creepers only scare you because they surprise you, whereas endermen are just terrifying. Um, zombies are no threat until unless there's a horde of them. Skeletons are just annoyingly overpowered. Spiders aren't too bad because they're two blocks wide, so you can just hide on a thin bit and you'll be fine. But they do climb walls, which is annoying. Um, what other mobs are there? And the dragon is just a bitch. Bats are just pointless. Why are you in the game? What do you do? Nothing. I don't think they even drop XP. Nope, they're just pointless. Ah, there goes my pickaxe. Um, luckily I had a spare. Okay, I should probably get out of here now. I have another basically stack of of iron. That's the word I'm looking for. He's kind of close. Um. Oh shit. Oh. Sweet, it managed to take no damage. A whole stack. Yeah, I'm gonna get out because what's the point of being in here if I have a whole stack of iron? I'll probably just die and lose it all. And I have no idea where I am. Left. This is the way out. It's night time though. So, not great. But let's just run. Creeper. Ah. Fuck. Skeleton. Right, let's smelt up some of this. And I'll be able to make myself some armor. Actually, that's enough for a big axe and a sword make me nice and attacky ah, and I can make a bow too awesome oh that's the wrong way um, there we go and I've got some arrows in here I've only got five but there if I need them in like a really bad situation I might as well have it with me I'll make another furnace as well no point just having one. Actually, a seven of one as well. And then they can just stack on top. I'm not sure where we're gonna live. We wanna live somewhere interesting, really. Okay, just in, living in a cave is probably not the best. Especially with all this water. It's really, really annoying. But mountains are usually good. I'm oh, sorry, I'm going to have to turn this down. This is doing my head in. There we go. Much better. Uh, let's get a little light there. Let's take some of that. And let's get a helmet. Some shoes. Chest plate. Not like that. And one more. And some legs. And chuck them on oh cool um what else could I make uh, I need um I can make a shovel and a normal axe and now I've got the whole gear oh wrong way 
and I could just throw these away. Get out of here. There we go. A perfectly organized inventory. Got my weapons there. Well, weapons and tools. Got my bow, torch, and food there. Food above. Ingredients for torch with some wood up there. Spare blocks to place. A bit of iron if I need it. I'll probably just put that in my chest. That's how I like to roll. Uh, that's nearly done. That's nearly done. Hooray, it's done. 27 iron spare after making tools and armor. Not bad. Plus Jamie's got 12 and 1. Ah, oh, that's already... damn it. Uh, do I have sand? That's sandstone. Let's kick some of that. Okay, let's go find Jamie. And see how he's doing. He said in the chat that he's found he found an iron vein and then he dug it and found another cave underneath. So this seed is incredible. We've got so many caves, especially around spawn as well. It's awesome. Unfortunately for anyone who joins after us, which is everyone because we're the only two on, they won't have as much luck because we've stripped a lot of stuff out of this world. Like a few, probably like two stacks of iron already. We've just stolen. But luckily, oh, there's where I fell in. But we um, we want people to explore further. Usually, we set up a Nether hub, which is if you don't know, you make a Nether portal at spawn, and then make a Nether portal at everyone's base, and then you just connect them in the nether because in the nether every one block you travel in the nether is eight blocks on land so it's an eighth of the distance in the nether so if you live like 800 blocks away hop into the nether, go 100 blocks come out and you're at your base so it saves time then you can just make like a 100 meter rail instead of an 800 meter rail which is very very useful um, not sure where that cave I went. Well, the cave I came out of. What was that? It's like unloaded chunks over there. Hmm. <laughs> I have no idea where he is. Oh, bunny. Ah, this is where it is. Um, let's hop in. Try find him. I found him. He's down here. Not sure how he got down there, but... Oh! Ow! Ow! Go away, night skeleton. Wait, is that two? Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Yeah, I'm gonna get out. This is not good. Good job I had armor on, or I would be dead. Whoa, hello. so bad. Do I push him? Should I push him? Mm. <laughs> yeah, right. With dynamic lights you can just drop a torch like that and then that the floor will light up down there. Which is very useful. Hmm. Alright, he's going back. I will follow. There's more iron up this way anyway, so I'll just grab a bit of this.
<laughs> oh, silly boy. It's probably night time again, isn't it? Yep. Oh dear lord, there are three skeletons. Ow! Oh no. Oh no. Run away! Oh my god! We are definitely on hard. Oh shit! Fucking hell! Oh my. This is not fun. Okay, I need to get food. And... <laughs> oh god. So many mobs. Shut up, cow. Way we made it. Alrighty, let's melt some of this up. Oh, he's got gold. Nice. And iron. Sweet. That's a lot of redstone. Lots of lava, more gold. Fucking hell. We're doing alright, aren't we? 49 iron. Fucking hell. That is a lot. It's night time, so we should probably sleep. Right, I'm gonna go for a little adventure. Oh. Hello, hello. What are you doing out of these parts of the woods, mate? Oh, we've got another cave over there. Got a cave there, cave there. This is a very cavey seed. Damn it, I suck at parkour. I'm gonna try. Ah, oh, there was that. There was that witch hut, wasn't there? I shall go and investigate that. So we've got a nice little swamp over here. have a little peek see what I can see maybe there'll be a little chest of goodies if I'm lucky who knows oh there it is swamps look a lot better in 1.7 was the update I think yeah they used to not look great but now they're very cool will there be a witch in it or is it just the hut I'm hoping just the hut, because witches are kind of hard to kill. Uh, nothing around here. Damn it! That's how bad I am at puzzle. I just bailed one block jump. Nope, just a cauldron. But I could take that be good for potions and stuff plus a plant pot decoration and mushrooms because why not um yeah cool let's have a little look around though see what we can see there's a lot of bunnies I love how smooth 1.8 is as well. It, um, they've done a lot of just eat before I talk because eating is noisy. Um, they've done a lot of optimization in 1.8. They've made they've added vertex buffer object. I don't know what that means, but it makes it run smoother. I think. I don't think that was in 1.7, but I think Optifine had the option for it. Um, they've added multi-core threading, which is just like a better way of loading the world. So if you press F3 and A, which reloads chunks, look how fast it is. Super speed. It used to be like chunk, 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 chunk. Now it's like chunk, 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 which is a lot nicer. And they've just made better optimizations so that it runs smoother. So if you were having 
trouble running it on your laptop before, or just a bad computer, uh, definitely worth trying it out again, see if you can run it. Okay, it doesn't seem like there's much out here. I guess that's the savannah slash desert that was that way. Our mountain is about there, for reference. Then we headed that way, off to the savannah, and the desert. So I guess that's part of it. So nothing really interesting around here. Just lots of bunnies to kill. That sound is so horrible. Oh, I killed a baby. You don't even get anything from them. I want to get a rabbit's foot because they're used for potion of leaping, which makes you jump two blocks high, which is awesome. I love that. Oh yeah, and they also added a 32 d chunk render distance to 1.8, which is incredible. I can't run it that well, because you need kind of a really good computer to record that, um, well, to run that especially recording but should I try it? I'm gonna stop the recording just because this might make me lag and might screw up my recording so right just restarted the recording let's chuck that up to 32 I just remembered that we're on a server so you can only see 12 I'm stupid that's probably why I could run it well, because it was actually only rendering 12 chunks. But I'll put a video up in the top right or something so you can see. I'll go in single player. But you're rendering 64 chunks, which is so 32 either side of you, plus the chunk you're in, so 65 chunks. Which is... I can't remember, I did work it out. I'll put it up now. It's that many blocks you're rendering roughly because you've got 65 chunks each is 16 by 16 and then each chunk is usually about well sea level is about 60 or 70 so most things are about um i say like 80 high because mountains but also because of caves so yeah that's, that's how many blocks you're rendering when you're on a 64 chunk render distance. That is insane. There's a lot of blocks. But I can't run it because we're on a server. I remember when I used to be on my laptop and I could. I was amazed when I installed Optifine and I could just about run 16 frame chunk render distance. Now 1.8 is out. I, I could probably run it quite well without Optifine or anything. I might go back on my laptop and check. Because I haven't played Minecraft on my laptop in forever, obviously, because I have a computer now. What's Jamie doing? Something. Um, nice. Lots of supplies. What's he making? What is he doing? Ah! Possibly an obsidian generator. Nope, just the lava stash. Cool. Yeah, good idea. I've never been. Yeah, cool. Eight? Really? Huh, I didn't. I always thought. I can't remember. This was quite a while ago. What? Oh, if you saw my race to the end, you know that I definitely don't know. But I thought. You can make portals bigger, but not smaller. He's on fire. Oh dear. Hmm, I don't know. We'll see. I've already been recording for another hour. That's two hours, but... There's a lot I'm going to cut from this, so... Oh. Haha. <laughs> yeah. He's tired. Okay. Okay, children, quiet down. 
I love South Park. I've recently been watching, rewatching, well, not rewatching. I guess. Well, I used. To, oh fuck, it's dark. I used to watch South Park every now and then when it was on TV or something, but I haven't watched TV in like well over a year, probably, maybe even two years. I mean, like, I might have watched a show once, but mm, I don't watch TV anymore. I just use YouTube and online things. So I recently got all 14 seasons of South Park on my laptop and I've been watching them all over again. I'm on season 5 now. Such a good show. I love it. And so it begins. People asking people to sleep. That's kind of... You see that a lot on the servers. Ah, he's going off. I'll probably get off in a bit then. Let's put my little plant pot down. Actually, that looks shit. Let's put a little birch tree sapling in it. Oh, it doesn't go in. I thought that did go in. Oh, what? Oh, he must have put that in. There we go. Ah, he killed it. How rude. Oh, he's moving it. Ah, oh, I'm drowning. Yeah, that's cool. I'm pooping. Oh, he left. Uh, I might get off then as well. Because I'm not really sure what to do without him. Kind of need to make the decisions together. Um, I lo ended it here last time though. So I'm going to go up there. Whoosh. Ta-da. Hurry editing. So, this is the end of episode 2. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I will leave a link to Jamie's part 2 when, well, he hasn't even started to record part 1, so it might be a while, but I'll put it in the description anyway when it comes out. Make sure you, I'll put his channel in the description too. Make sure you go subscribe to him. Uh, I'll put the website link in the description for if you want to join this beautiful world. Um, not sure when part three will be. Probably, probably. I don't know. I recorded part one and two off straight after, but I need to edit them. So probably next week sometime. Hope you enjoyed, and goodbye. <laughs>